to keep your be on your best behavior. The NSA is watching. Uh, you heard me say that. I'm gonna get Snowden. I know they live in the Russian the airport. Air what do you think the rates on Russian airports are? I'm hearing red a utility closet on a minimum wage salary. So are you just so away in the office? Live in the, office. Live in the broom closet of the Russian embassy. Yeah. And I keep switching to display two. Disp. Display two, more like display boo. Oh! <laughs> so we each get like two lines in the intro. I like it. Oh, oh sick. Trap Jeopardy. Trap Jeopardy, more like. <laughs> Oh, I didn't start yet. Yeah. Okay. Is this twenty four care magic? That didn't start yet. Okay. <laughs> Oh, it was a quick clip of me dancing. Well, good. Preview for what is to come. <laughs> for the good meme that is to come. Only Nate were here for this letter on him. Let's get to the video set. So, haters gonna hate this because this is awesome. And do what? What are we, what are we gonna do? Just leave it playing, Ethan. Yeah, just leave it playing. Yeah, okay. seriously. You play Puzzle one more time, that screen's gonna go through that screen and that screen. Oh. I forget how long this intro is. Uh, it's, he walked out and he's almost. He's, he's walking out now. Yeah. Alright. I just realized how messed up he should talk. This is for Karen, you know it, dude. You know this album is garbage, right? Just a hater. It's like objectively bad, though. That's my point. Hater's gonna hate. Ethan. What? This is God speaking. What? 24 karat magic is garbage, no, and not. you know it. No. I told you. Good morning, Africa. I'm Edwin. And I'm Ethan Brubaker. Today is Tuesday, February 20th. Please, Please rise for a moment of silence to push the flag. Come on, man. Oh. <laughs> Keep it. Come on, God. Why you gotta cut me off like <laughs> that? So yeah, we're now, we're now conservative vote sync. So that's nice. No, no, no. Are you up for an adventure? Willing to try something you never have before? No. Go on a blind date. With a book this February. The entire month, there will be books covered, some with topics, genres, and minimal information on the outside available for checkout. Every blind date you check out, you'll be entered to win a free drink at the Media Center. Fall in love with a good book. Okay. <laughs> this week, we are celebrating National FFA Week. Today, we are dressing up as our favorite ag animal, or any animal. As part of our celebration, we are hiding one mini tractor in school each day. If you find one of the hidden tractors, take it out right on down to room 316 and you get a $5 gift card. Each day, there will be a different gift card. You do not have to be a part of FFA to participate. Good luck. Now for our ag trivia. Did you know of the 3.3 million farm operators, 1 million are women? That's like over 30%, dude. In celebration of agriculture and National FFA Week, please remember to wear your FFA colors tomorrow. Freshmen and sophomores should wear yellow, while juniors and seniors should wear blue. Attention juniors, Millersville University will be hosting a college fair on Thursday, March 15th. This fair attracts approximately 150 different colleges 
universities, and trade school representatives. This is a great opportunity for the 11th graders to interact with and learn more about different colleges. The itinerary includes attending the college fair, having lunch in the dining hall, and taking a campus tour. If you're interested in attending, please print out a field trip information packet from Schoology. Space is limited, so don't delay. Now over to Jarrell Straley with the news. Jarrell. Robert Moeller. <laughs> The Office of Special Prosecutor Robert Mueller claims to now be in the position of a list of names of 13 Russians that have been charged by a grand jury with interference in the 2016 U United States presidential election. Shocker there. <laughs> Deputy Attorney General of the United States commented on the charges on Friday, stating the indictment alleges that the Russian conspirators want to promote discord in the United States and undermine public confidence in democracy. The President has obviously denied all parts of any allegation implying that he received assistance in the 2016 election from the Russian government. On this day in history, Lieutenant Colonel John Herschel Glenn Jr. was successfully launched into space to complete the first orbit around the Earth. Glenn was a de decorated pilot in both World War II and the Korean War. He is also accredited with the first supersonic flight across the United States. Throughout the flight, the ship had problems with the air conditioning and the automatic controls, and by the end of Glenn's final orbit, the heat shirt was absorbing the impact of entering Earth's atmosphere like it should have. After a fiery descent into the Atlantic Ocean, Mission Control was relieved to hear Glenn's voice after four minutes of radio silence saying, It was hot in there. Now, back to the main desk for lunch. Hey, yo, for lunch today we got cheesy chili nachos. Uh, breaded <coughs> chicken patty with a wooget roll. There you go. Papa, John, Papa John's pizza. Crispy chicken wrap. Fruit and yogurt par parfait with muffin. Uh, buffalo chicken salad. Sweet potato fries. Green pepper strips and dip. Uh, Tex-Mex bon salad. Uh, sorted fresh fruit or that slushy. <laughs> <laughs> oh. Okay. Well, that's new. Is this the new sports in here? I think so. It's high quality, I bet it's that. I think this is the first time traffic that would be featured. So many camera changes that I like it. In sports resorts, boys basketball lost to Lower Dolphin. Indoor track relay team heading to the state championship. The indoor track team will be sending the boys a 4 by 8 team of Tyler Shu, Tanya Moose, AJ Morales, and Andrew Foster to Penn State University this coming weekend to compete in the indoor state championship meet. The boys are currently seated sixth in the state in the event, having a runtime of eight minutes and six seconds at an indoor meet held this season at FM University. Also competing as an individual in the Open 800 meter will be sophomore Tyler Shu, who also is seated sixth in the event, in which he recently set a school record of one minute 56 seconds at a meet held recently at Lehigh University. Good luck, gentlemen. Today in, uh, today in sports, Olympic schedule. Now back to the main desk. Let's run the low. From today until Wednesday, February 21st, that is us tomorrow, Friends of Rachel is providing you the opportunity to write and send someone a special message. Stop in the media center anytime between now and then and help make someone's day. You can also just write an encouraging message to the general student population and we'll take it from there. In return, you will receive something sweet. Aloha, dudes. <coughs> Wanna come to our Hawaiian mini thon on March 3rd? Many thon registrations are due tomorrow, February 21st, to be guaranteed a t-shirt. Please see Mrs. Associate Mr. Martin for a registration form. Once again, many thon registrations are due tomorrow, February 21st, to be guaranteed a t-shirt. Please see Mrs. Associate Mr. Martin for a registration form. <laughs> That's our show for today. Have a day. Look at that kid. Have a day. Happy February he 20, cool. 20, 20th. He is the best. He is 25 carat badge. Oh, That's how cool he is. I'm gonna die. Ah, <laughs> oh, yes! The superior. <laughs> I love this. I love this clip. This.